home has improved. And you managed to grow a beard. Have you considered my offer? The Straw Hats can't save your uncle. We'll be lucky if we survive the week. It's that bad? We're starving. I was out here hunting for food, and I'm returning to my men empty-handed. But not alone. Take me to your camp. We'll figure something out on the road. <laughs> Just like old times. Planning to walk? Don't you have a horse? Come on. When was the last time we saw each other? Two summers ago. Lord Nagao's tournament. I looked for you after the tournament ended. Straw had saw our duel. They needed a new sword. It seemed like fun. You never visited my uncle's castle. There wasn't work there. I would have helped you become a retainer of Clan Shimura. You only had to ask. I made my own way. Another wagon. Might have something we can salvage. Empty. Samurai! Samurai! Was this your wagon? Yes, my lord. Mongols stole my horse, took my rice. You're lucky that's all you lost. Which way did the Mongols go? Toward Fort Ohira. Damn it. Take refuge at the Golden Temple. Warn others to stay off these roads. Yes, my lord. Let's keep moving. My camp's not far. I meant what I said before. Help free Lord Shimura, and he'll grant you anything in his power. What's he got the power to give? He can declare the Straw Hearts a samurai clan, and make you their lord. On an island, conquered by Mongols. We will drive them out. Your name will appear in the Shogun's official records. You really believe that? I believe it's worth fighting for. I've always been a dreamer. It can't have been easy keeping the Straw Hats together after Komodo Beach. How did you do it? I convinced them nobody can save us but ourselves. That's true. I used to think so. But it's starting to feel like a lie. How many men do you have? We're down by half. But still enough to call ourselves a small army. Why? That peasant said the Mongols stole his rice and went to Fort Ohira. You think they're hoarding food there? Possibly. Do you have an idea? The beginning of one. Easy, Shinzo. It's me. He's here! You use those back! <laughs> About time. I don't see any food. Men! This is my old friend, Lord Sakai. Yuzo told me you're starving. I'm here to help. You didn't find food. We have a plan. Raid Fort Ohira and take back the food Mongols have stolen from our people. Raid a fort? They'll kill us! Give us a moment. Come with me, Jin. We should have talked about your idea before telling my men. I wanted to give them hope. That's my job. I meant no disrespect. It's fine. Through here, Jin. If you ride with the Straw Hats, you have to look the part. I've got a spare set of armor that should fit. You'd better not have lice. Never letting me forget that, are you? Spare armor's in the chest. <laughs> You're not as handsome as me, but... It's not bad. We should check the fort's defenses. Look for weak spots. 
My men will handle that part. Then we have a deal? Get us that food at the Fort Ohira. And we'll get your uncle away from the Mongols. Thank you, Yuzo. Just remember who's in charge of the Straw Hats. I will never dream of replacing you, my friend. Give us a head start. We'll meet you at the old cemetery. See you there. Men, we're moving out. Those should be in the cemetery.
Good. You're here. You ready to steal some food for us? Is this everyone? Just the men who can fight worth the damn. The rest are too hungry or sick. Let's hope we're enough to raid the fort. There's a better chance of seeing cherry blossoms in winter than getting that food. There's always a way. Preferably one that doesn't kill half my men. A lot of men inside, and a signal at the top of the tower. If they call reinforcements from the bay, we'll be trapped. They'll cut us to pieces. Find a place to watch for me. Once I destroy their signal, attack. They'll kill you. If they do, avenge me, and take their food. That's not funny. <laughs> watch the tower for my signal. If you say so.
That's the last of them. Look around. Let's get your men something to eat. Where's all the food? I didn't see any in the tower. Did you find anything? Just a stack of Mongol papers on a dead officer. Let me see. You read Mongolian? If it's in Chinese, I can make out some of it. Since when? Since I had to read Sun Tzu. This was only a temporary depot. They're taking everything. Offshore. The boats are in the bay. We'll never get out to them. We got in here. You're crazy. What did you have in mind? Let's see what we're up against. The Mongols have small boats on the beach. We could steal one, but we'd have to cut through their army. Too many barriers and archers. A frontal attack would be suicide. I want my men far away from the enemy's line. Flaming arrow might set off those explosives. That will get their attention. But we need them to look away from the beach. Put your archers on that cliff. The Mongols will focus on them while we steal a boat. All right, men. They don't know we took the fort, so they'll be waiting for reinforcements that aren't coming. Keep them busy long enough for us to steal a boat. Then retreat into the forest. Look for my torch. That's your signal to attack. Let's find a way down to the beach. You heard, Yuzo. Let's move. We won't let you down. Watching you fight back there reminded me of Lord Nagao's tournament. You did whatever it took to win. It was a competition. You fought just as hard. Did I? What are you getting at? Nothing. Just remembering our duel. We'll talk about this later. If we survive. Your men should be in position. Light the torch. Now. I knew they'd come through. Look at that fire! Yeah. <laughs> 